Two exceptional pieces of armour dating back to the 16th century have been returned to the Louvre in Paris. They were stolen in the early 1980s. The helmet and breastplate, thought to be worth around half a million euros, were found by an auctioneer in Bordeaux. The BBC's Tim Orman has the story. Back where they belong, nearly 40 years after they first vanished. Exquisitely ornate, inlaid with gold and silver, some of the finest examples of the Renaissance. Today, the Central Office for Cultural Property is presenting the Louvre with two pieces of Italian Renaissance armament, a helmet and a breastplate. These are quite exceptional pieces that date back to the 16th century, objects of pomp and circumstance. The two pieces of armour were donated to the Louvre in 1922, part of a collection owned by the Baroness de Rothschild. How they went missing still remains something of a mystery. How they were recovered, not so much. An expert in military antiquities in Bordeaux has been asked to examine these two objects. He has doubts about them and contacted the authorities. They checked and found out that these objects have been stolen in 1983. The Louvre is still closed, of course, as the pandemic continues. But eventually restrictions will ease, the museum will reopen. And after nearly four decades, these exceptional objects will be back on display. Tim Allman, BBC News.